Hello, everyone. The fire, Fargo sirens just sounded. The radar, it's getting active. I'll have the details on what's going on in your quick afternoon update right here. A Hutch's weather update with Chief Meteorologist Hutch Johnson. Brought to you by Robert Gibb and Sons. Made a note on this on Facebook moments ago, but essentially the uh, Fargo community had scheduled a test of the outdoor siren system today as a result of some work being completed on a radio system on a water tower. So that's what was going on. There's no severe weather here in the FM area. We do have strong storms working out into that Wadena area, the Brainerd Lakes area right now. So heavy rain, western Becker County, uh, Manoman and Ada County is also seeing it, as well as Clay County, it's starting to exit. So it'll sell down here in that Wadena area over the Henning region, starting to produce some areas of hail, possibly with that. That's moving off to the east. It's heading towards Staples, Bertha, and Todd County, as well as Parker's Prairie right now. Now, there's still a risk for some severe weather tonight, but a couple of things. Number one, we're not seeing much going on on the radar. That risk is going to be reassessed as we approach the uh, 3 p.m. time frame this afternoon by the Storm Prediction Center. But Hutch's thoughts and guts are... My uh, gut feeling is that with all of the clouds we have dancing around the skies today, we may not see as much of a potential for severe weather in as wide of an area. The satellite showing that we are seeing a break in the clouds, but it's way out to the west in the western Dakotas. That's where things will be heating up first. And look at this down towards South Dakota. We're seeing some clearing there. This little batch of sunshine will destabilize the air there. But for now, until these clouds clear out just a little bit, we may not, we may not get to those temperatures required to see those bursts of rising pockets of air across our area. I will keep you posted. Keep in mind, we still have a risk of severe storms in our region tonight. Right now, it looks like the best chance for a few firing up along the South Dakota border here where we're getting some sunshine, southern Minnesota and portions of South Dakota. The main wave of energy, though, does start arriving as we go through the overnight, so strong and windy storms overnight will be possible as well. I'll keep you updated in your hour-by-hour -hour forecast coming up here in a bit, but for now, that's why the sirens were sounding. We have some strong storms heading into Wadena, Todd County, as well as the Brainerd Lakes area. Be ready for those. Stay tuned to me here on HutchesWeather.com anytime, anywhere. Interactive radar, track the storms, know before you go. Follow on Facebook and subscribe on YouTube and have a wonderful Tuesday afternoon. I'll be back.